Mohammed Abdelhamed from 90 Day Fiancé revealed he is still in America by posting a video that shows a very different side to him. 49-year-old wife Arellano from Albuquerque met 26-year-old Mohammed from Egypt when he slid into her DMs to praise her bikini pic. Despite their age gap of 23 years, single mom wife pursued the relationship and flew to meet Muhammad, after which they got engaged. However, there was more to Muhammad than just his chiseled body, because as soon as he reached America, Muhammad claimed he wanted his future wife to be like his mother, pushed wife to convert to Islam, rushed their wedding date, and cheated on her with his mystery girlfriend. Muhammad's leaked texts to his girlfriend were seen by fans online, as 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 showed him and wife having a fairy tale marriage. They were even together at the Tell All, but in the last few minutes of the reunion, TLC revealed the texts. Off screen, Wive was accused of domestic abuse by Muhammad as she soon announced her wish to get divorced. But while fans thought it would mean Muhammad getting deported from the States, he's been working and celebrating Thanksgiving there. In a new blog shared by Muhammad on his YouTube channel, Muhammad spoke about how Thanksgiving to him means sharing with the less privileged. He filmed himself driving around finding homeless people and handing them food. The 90 Day Fiancé star commented, you can lose your job, your health in one second. Just remember you can be in need one day. Muhammad believes that if one wants to be rich or have blessings in their life, one needs to share what they have with others. 90 Day Fiancé fans want Muhammad to get deported A clip of Muhammad's video was posted on Reddit by user Femme underscore Fatal 2022 to ask other 90 Day Fiancé fans for their thoughts on it. Some fans were appreciative of Muhammad's gesture and how he chose to not show the faces of the people he was helping. But at the same time, they argued that it would have been better if 90 Day Fiancé cast member Muhammad had done his good deeds without filming it and trying not to get attention out of it. Muhammad is probably doing this to make it look like he's a nice guy after everything that has happened with Wive, wrote Princess Soprano, who called it a calculated move on Muhammad's behalf to make himself look like a saint. When there was news of Wai being charged with battery and assault after an alleged altercation with Muhammad, her reps said the allegations were false. They spoke about the charges being made up by Muhammad, so he could continue staying in the U. S, and avoid being sent back home to Egypt, 90 Day Fiancé fans claimed Muhammad had discussed this since the beginning with the woman he was chatting with and had specifically talked about a U visa and how Muhammad could qualify for one in case Wive became aware of his cheating. Back in August, Eve's lawyer had suggested Muhammad may be deported and possibly blacklisted from future entry into the United States. But him still being in the country does puzzle 90 Day Fiancé fans. Moreover, Muhammad is not just working at one job but claims to have had multiple jobs since his split with Wive. Fans still don't know who Muhammad's girlfriend is, and it's possible the former 90 Day Fiancé star will keep everyone guessing about what eventually happens to him once he gets divorced from Wive. Source, Muhammad Abdelhamadou, Femme underscore Fatal 2022, Reddit. Thing and print, thing, thing, thing and print.